All right, guys, uh, today we're gonna be working on step 12. Uh, we do skip step 11 because I'm not installing a VOR antenna, and 11 has you install that antenna on the top. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and skip that step, do step 12, which we're gonna Clico the skin to the skeleton. And once we get a Clico, we're gonna check the alignment, make sure it's completely straight, and then we'll go ahead and rivet it. So let's go ahead and get started on that. Right, guys I'm having a hell of a time getting these holes to line up with the rib underneath and I stick my finger in here and I think we riveted the rib to this side when it was supposed to bend to this side which this side lines up with the holes so I'm gonna have to unclico this whole thing drill out these rivets and rivet the rib to this side of the bracket and then rivet that back bracket back in so we'll go ahead and get uh, going on that All right, I got them drilled out. I moved the rib, the rib was here, attached to this, this bracket. I slid it down and attached it to this one. That should solve our alignment issues. The holes should line up now. Um, we'll go ahead and match the skin up and see if it aligns. And then if it does, I'll go ahead and rivet these on. And then we'll uh, click all the skin on and continue on with the step. Okay guys, uh, just checking the alignment. I've got the green line running right through the center of all the holes. And it's uh, going straight up through that floor. So I'm walking the laser hand back. Looks to be aligned. I'll check uh, the other sides as well. All right, I got the alignment. It's going right through that center of that hole. The center of that bracket. I've got the vertical part of the laser lined up with the rivets. Keeps going to the center and right through the middle of that rivet. So it's pretty, pretty straight. Okay, uh, since it all lines up really nicely, we're gonna go ahead and rivet this. Um, these silver Clicos, they're supposed to really um, be the 3.2 millimeter, the same as these copper ones. The holes don't quite line up, so I'm just gonna match drill those and then rivet those as well. So that's what these are here. So wherever it's dimpled, we'll put the flush 3.2 rivets, and then here we'll put the domed 3.2 rivets. So let's go ahead and get started on that.
All right, guys, we got it completely riveted. These two holes are rib nuts. That's gonna be the next step. Uh, the rib nuts are in the mail. I ordered some. We used up all the rib nuts on when we had to drill those other ones out a few steps ago, but skins look good. Um, next weekend, I'll get those rib nuts and finish the vertical stabilizer. For real-time updates on the build, please follow me on Instagram, brads underscore aviation underscore channel. Also follow my builder's blog at bradsslingtsi.wordpress.com. Vertical stabilizer step 12 took four hours. Total time on the empennage, 87 hours, 35 minutes. Please like this video. If you have any questions for me, leave it in the comments below. Subscribe and hit that bell so that you'll receive notifications. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next week.